Sarah Beth was pushing for Hannah again. Tiffany was saying, put Brittany up. I've put, I would be sus if I was Sarah Beth, as Brittany is not a threat. <laughs> Don't you think it's kind of obvious that they're sort of working with Hannah? For, um... <laughs> you have a nigga you've called in as a, as a, as a, when yeah. we call Brittany, Brittany. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <on> <laughs> exactly. Sorry, say that again. Don't you think it's a bit sus, like, them all sort of protecting Hannah? Like, it's so obvious they're in an alliance with her. They're managing to see, seemingly get away with it. Like, her. as if Britney's a threat to anyone, apart from my eardrums in the diary room. <laughs> I put... Sarah Beth was frustrated that the others weren't recognising Hannah as a mm. threat. She seemed to be, like, getting visibly aerated about in the diary room yeah and then she was going oh she's good for your game but she's not good for my game and it's like oh you're not HOH oh, again you're not HOH so he gives a fuck about your game better get back in your box yeah. or this won't be good for your game yeah exactly win HOH and you can decide what to do silly cow um, I do like Sarah Beth but I didn't like her coming for Hannah because Hannah's better TV Tiffany was saying that Whitney has a reason to target their team mm. and might come for the guys in the Royal Flush that was the sort of like it's like a witch hunt, isn't it? Whitney's like, not doing anything, let's no. be honest. Is she? She's just literally just Apart sat there. Modelling impractical gym work. Yeah, that's it. She's got no game. <laughs> She's like no threat to anyone. To even bother to get her out is just absolutely stupid. Um, so then uh, uh, they said, oh, but it's your decision, Christian. Christian didn't seem to know what the fuck to do, did he? Um, then the Jokers came up to campaign. Uh, God, who was that? I'm supposed to know. Derek uh, F and that. Arza, Derek F and Brit Brittini. Um, Brit Brat. So Chris, Christian said, this team has target e targeted each other to get each other out. Oh, that was about the aces. And then Derek F said, Whitney was going to put Christian on the block, which he was lying about. He made that up. He's lying. Well, yeah. But she did say that... Um... It flashed back to, like, someone from that team has to go up, wasn't mm. it? We'll come to that anyway. Yeah. Up at this backfired because mm. Christian thinks oh, that they yeah. will come for Whitney anyway. Even he That was it. That, he said, what's the point in me wasting my week going after Whitney if they're all going to go after her next week? Which yeah. was another great yes. point that he didn't pay any attention to. Oh, so close. <laughs> and Hannah is the better option now. Mm. I've got the power, he said. Yeah. I, I mean, mean, I like Hannah, but... He's right. Yeah. He's right. Um... Xavier was upset because his team are too smart oh, to yeah. be manipulated. <laughs> yeah, he said, I hate that my team is smart. Um, but I've said, even if Hannah does go up, couldn't they save her with the votes either way? I guess we're going to find out tonight. I'll put, Christian is bringing Hannah in for a one-to-one -one <laughs> about going up as a pawn. Mm. One -one. Oh, yeah, she was just like, mm, no, nah, don't. not really feeling that. The thing is, she manages to act like... Um, they've got a personal connection even though she says she doesn't care to get to know him yeah. she sort of played on it and was like you know yeah. we're like this and that yeah. and he was like yeah I know we are probably because she's like a bit kind of cool and aloof and it, it, do you know what I mean like she's got a 90s hair going yeah on. she's got the bucket hat he's like mm, well, you know maybe she's good for she's my game she's a groovy chick <laughs> <laughs> so Hannah told him to put up a joker and she said you have the most comp wins and I can protect you and I thought pointing out his comp wins, I don't think is good because that's making him think, oh, could target. I be a target? Yeah. Um, What's this? The argument, he can't put up Derek X mm. as he will go against Whitney. Mm. What does that mean? I have no idea. Someone was saying put Derek X up. He said he can't because that goes against Whitney. Oh, does it? Oh, he oh, said on the same he team. will go over Whitney. Oh, if, yeah, if that was X it. Yeah. Block, Who was he... telling him to put Derek X up? I don't know. No, Hannah's dating Derek X. I don't know why she was saying it, but she was. Ooh, fair enough. No, I don't think she was. Maybe he was like just... Oh, yeah, pontificating. Yeah. She was like, well, you know, maybe someone else. <laughs> Couldn't have said it better myself, literally. <laughs> Hannah's do or die conversation. She goes in for not game related. Mm. Yeah, she said that. Yeah. She said not game related, but I wouldn't nah. do that to you. Bollocks. That is game related. But she's pulling at his heartstrings. Nice. Yay! She should pull at his pigtails while she's at it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she reeled off his comp wins. It's mm. the most in the house. She said she won't put him up if she wins. 
And I don't know how many other people in this house can promise you that. Mm. It's a strong argument. Yeah, she, she made. did make a good argument. She said that he is he has an ally in her mm. and he will lead her down the line, mm. you know, further down the track. Oh yeah, and then he was like he has to turn on his own team. Yeah, and I think in the diary he was like, Oh yeah, it would be good to have her in, as an ally later down the line. And then he put her up. It's like, oh she can be an ally now. I wrote down she's good, then the noms came, so mm. and then she got nominated. Right, it failed after <laughs> Hannah's name. <laughs> Um, I put hope. I hope Hannah wins the veto. And then Whitney was like, "Oh, I'm confused. I didn't know it was gonna go up. Or do you ever bother to like campaign, talk game, anything? Stupid." Should <sighs> <sighs> have a break. Uh, yeah, just in that end, that bit there, Hannah was going like, "I will win the veto. I will take myself off the block." Mm, she didn't. I will find you. <laughs> <laughs> and I will yeah. kill you. That was good. I like that one. Stop quoting all your tweets. My tweets are my notes. I just oh. tweet my notes. So oh. the best bits, the highlights. Gaz's best bit. Yeah. Okay, let's pause for a wee wee. Yeah. Wee wee. And we're back. To talk about the veto. Whitney started off by saying she felt blindsided and backstabbed. Oof. Um, she didn't expect the game to be so difficult. I've put try playing it. Go cool, I'm quite bitchy today. <laughs> um, by the way, I don't have like notes on the start of this episode i watched okay. it today okay while i was officially working oh yeah oh uh hello is this gaz's hr department <laughs> so the notes are <laughs> um hannah said something about hus- uh, her husband i don't know if that was derek x derek x is not happy that she's been put up the kings decided who should be the target sarah beth was pushing for hannah yeah we know christian thinks whitney is best whitney going is best for his game well that's wrong and he thinks hannah won't put him up Sarah Beth is not happy that Xavier is happy that Whitney is basically solidified as a target. So it was like, he did the nominations and he was like, I'm not quite sure who I want to be the target. And then someone obviously whispered in his ear and they decided the target was Whitney. Mm -hmm. I hope the target is still Whitney. I don't want her to go. Well, she would be the better game move, but it's not, don't worry, it's not going to switch between that show and this. I hope not. Um... Sarah Beth said she knows that Xavier is desperate to keep her. She literally mm. said desperate. Ooh. She's going to sh- shut up about it, though, to avoid making herself a target I've got here. Mm. Is that the right place? Or... Yeah, she knew when to back down. Christian told Hannah to lay low. Whitney said she was number 10 on the pissed off level. Oh, uh, yeah. Z- Xavier said to Whitney, I wanted to find out <laughs> where you're at mm. on a pissed off level. Mm. About a 10. Where where are you at on the pissed off level? Oh, it depends. Lindsay? Does it go up to 10 or does it go up to 100? I think 10 is the top. Well, I'm not too pissed off right now. I'd say 4. Oh, <laughs> but you're like house moving drama. Yeah, it's but. Quite I'm a not, 10, though. No? Yeah, but I'm not thinking about that. Oh, this right. Exact, now. Right at this exact moment. Oh, right. in life, yeah, about 7. <laughs> <laughs> right here, right now, about 4. Okay. About Chilled. 4. <laughs> Horizontal. What about you? Uh. I'm about an eight oh, at the moment. God. Because work's been really hard. Mm. And this, well, actually, it's better now. So if you asked me yesterday, we've mm. been te- about ten because mm. my internet's not been working. Oh, yeah. Try not having the internet for four days and working from home. It's not nice. Oh, it's not good. <sighs> oh, I said to them, you need to give me compensation mm. for that. Mm. And they calculated because it's oh, based yeah. on my bill and the oh, downtime yeah. that. Yeah, it's yeah. £2.39 or something. And I was yeah, like, I'll take it. <laughs> but we'll give you £5 credit on your account. Like, oh, yeah. yeah. All right, then. <laughs> <laughs> good deal Good deal going on there. <laughs> so, um, oh, yeah. Xavier said that Whitney said all the kings have to go. But what she actually said was one of the kings have to go because they showed the flashback. Yes. So it was like she kind of said it but kind of didn't say it. Well, she, it, she was... It was true when she said, it wasn't your name. I never had your name in no. my mouth. I never said your name. She didn't yeah. actually say names. She wasn't going around showing, <laughs> name, showing names. I should hope not. That is extremely devious. <laughs> um, so, um, she's right. Yeah, so she's right there. She didn't say Xavier's Exav- Exav- name. Mm. She could have been trying to cover her soft spot for him. Mm. She does have a soft spot for him. So Whitney went to talk to Christian. She said Derek X had blamed Whitney for saying she would go after them. And then Whitney Waterworks, I've written. Christian knows she's lying. But she, I don't think she is lying. No, I think he said, I know she's lying. She's lying. Even though she's not. <laughs> yeah, she's lying. <laughs> I put, so dumb to get her out over Hannah, she has no alliance. Whitney crying said, I really thought we were friends. Which is at the point where I actually felt mm. quite sorry for Lindsay. Mm. For who? 
the flimsy for <laughs> Whitney. Sorry, <laughs> <laughs> I'm quite sorry for you as well. Just generally, just in general. <laughs> um, I've got a question. Yeah. Have you ever done a burpee <laughs> and then a push up and done a black backflip? <laughs> I've not even ever done one of those things. <laughs> Let alone all three in one go. Who? Who? What did this remind you of? Sabong. Yeah. <laughs> I've written the old Sabong treatment. <laughs> showing off. One fingered hand snap press ups. Showing off about your physical prowess and Big Brother. What is the point? It's just an ego trip. Did you see that as a gif? No, as a clip on Twitter. Nah. That clip of him doing that went yeah. around on Twitter with yeah. the caption, This is not an animated gif on loop. Ah! And it literally looked like it was, but mm. it was actually a video of him flipping again mm. and again and again and that again. It's quite impressive, isn't it? Yeah, but it's not good to do that in front of everyone in Big Brother. It's stupid, big brother. isn't it? Take a leaf out of Sue Bong's playbook. When Turn over don't. a new life. Yeah, get back in your cage. I've put, looks like he's going to break his neck. Stupid showing how fit you are. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Arza has a crush on Zay. Oh, this was interesting. Uh, she doesn't like to share and she's jealous of Whitney. She's pissed off. She's looking mm. at me there, giving her the side eye. Mm. And then she got Xavier in the bedroom. I was like, "Why did she tell him that? <laughs> that is that was a dumb move, oh, wasn't it?" Was it was so embarrassing, wasn't it? Talk you could tell he he was just like, mm. "Yeah." <laughs> Talk about like creating an awkward situation yeah. for yourself. Yeah. Once he's out there, how are you going to be comfortable and relaxed around him now? No. And then in the dome, he's like, "Oh, she's very beautiful, but oh, she's you know, a queen. Operation oh, Nomad, like goddess." Yeah, but like... yeah, it's like he's got no interest in her whatsoever. Um. It's a shame. Arsa's game is just absolutely she's, diabolical. She hasn't got one. No. Apparently, she's is she not a replacement? She's a super fan. No, they tried to recruit her sister, and then she, she uh, recommended Arsa. Yeah. Fuck knows why. Um, <laughs> referred a friend. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, Derek X said he wants to win the veto and save Whitney or Hannah. Um, Alyssa wants Derek X to win it and not use it. Oh yeah, she was kind of like putting the putting the. Not feelers on him. What was she doing? Who? Alyssa. She was like, oh, Christian wants to keep his nominations the same, so if you win the veto, we don't want you to use it. To Derek X. Yeah, and Derek X is obviously going to use it on Hannah because she's basically his girlfriend, I think. What did he say? He was just like, oh, yeah, you know, it's a really difficult decision. Well, I feel like he was... There was a bit where it was like a bit of a flim flam, but I was like, is he really like not sure what to do? No, I think he was just sort of... Waiting and to see if he won it before he committed to anything. I've written here, Derek X is lying to Whitney that he wants to win the veto. Mm. Though in the diary room he says he does want to win it to but keep save Hannah. Whitney and Hannah safe. You can't keep but both of them safe. what about the royal flush then? Because he wants to keep them safe because they're on his team. On the one hand. Mm. They're on his team. Yeah, but he needs to stick with the royal flush. That's where the power's at. Yeah, but what about Hannah? She's his well. she's, she's bae. <laughs> Hannah asked Derek X if she can pick him for house guest choice mm. yeah she was like getting consent beforehand oh uh, yeah um, and he agreed she doesn't want to pick someone from the cookout to mm. avoid arousing suspicion mm. that she's working with them mm. she was smart this girl oh yeah and then Whitney's felt betrayed because Hannah picked Derek X I know she, he will take her off and not me why does she feel betrayed? What's Hannah supposed to do? Not pick her own boyfriend when she's on the block as well? I think it's stupid. Well, yeah. I don't know if they're betrayed. a boyfriend. Well, you know, they're a flirt man. Don't at least. forget uh, what happened before that. Are you? No, oh, I have forgotten. I've written that Derek X is stuck between the Royal Flash and the Aces. Is that real flim flam? I'm not sure. Mm. I said... Don't you? They had a funny bit, do you remember? No. It was Arza hmm. falling over. Oh, yeah, that was doing good. a moonwalk. Yeah. But it's a bit embarrassing to do a moonwalk anyway, isn't it, given who it's associated with? <laughs> I know, people just seem to turn a blind eye, don't yeah. they? And she did it in front of Xavier as well. And they did the slow motion yeah. fall back. You fell Ooh. over. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's not a great episode for Arza, was it? No. <laughs> um, yeah, go on. Yeah, go on, veto pick. Tiffany clocked Sarah Beth moaning about not getting picked for veto. Oh, yeah. Sarah Beth's like, oh, I didn't get picked for veto. I've never played veto. Yeah. And Tiffany was like, why is she making it all about her? It's not about her. And Jack said the exact same thing. Jack said it just before Tiffany said it. Why is she making this all about her? Oh. And then Tiffany said the exact same thing. Must have got an email at this point because I missed that. She was making a scene. Um, and then Tiffany went up to Hannah 
and the gave her a, yeah, gave her a heads up. She said she's had her name, your your name in her mouth. Yeah. I was like, yes, because at the start of the episode, you probably missed this because on fast speed you don't clock it. I tell you what, the start of this episode, I started mm. playing this episode. I thought mm. it was the same one that yeah. I'd already watched because oh. the intro was was exactly the same. Oh, but at the start of the episode, they showed Tiffany saying, I can't remember what it was, but something like, I'm done with her. Or she 